Hi sisters, it's Jake here and I'm back with another video. Today I'm, I'm here to welcome a good pal of mine, somebody who I've made a video with in the past. He's been killing it recently. My friend and soon to be neighbor, Saji Sharma. Hi sisters, so happy to be here, Jake. I really, really am happy that you're, you're having me on the channel. Of course, of course. It's been a long time coming and uh, finally have gotten around to it. The last video that I made with Saji, we reviewed Euphoria, which went well. And then we recreated some scenes of Euphoria. That were pristine, such good. Pristine and honestly romantic. 100%. Whoops, sorry to just barge in here like that. I'm here to say today's video is sponsored by glassesusa.com. That's right, today we have a sponsor and they sent me these styling glasses, are you kidding me? By cutting out the middleman, Glasses USA offers over 9,000 prescription glasses and sunglasses, including in-house brands such as Muse and Amelia E, as well as designer brands like Ray-Ban and Gucci, all up to 70% off retail prices. At glassesusa.com, you can shop for all your eyewear needs at affordable prices online, starting at only $30 with basic prescription lenses included. And you don't have to leave your house. Perfect for people who don't leave their house like me. GlassesUSA.com also has contact lenses and blue light glasses. I look at my computer all day. It's my job. In the past, I've used blue light glasses and it's really made a difference. Also, shopping at GlassesUSA.com is a risk-free experience. You get free shipping and returns and 100% money back guarantee within the first 30 days. No questions asked. GlassesUSA.com USA.com also has a virtual try-on tool on the website, which helped me find my pair. I'm super picky about how glasses look on my face, so this was super helpful. All I had to do was like serve looks, I guess, and show off my hot face. So I got to pick three frames that I liked the most. So I picked these because they're familiar, they remind me of my old glasses, and there's a little pop of gold on the side. I also picked these big boys if I wanted to feel a little sassy. And then, oops, am I rocking it right now? Yeah obviously. So if you want to check out glassesusa.com, the links will be in the top of the description below. They're super affordable, they're well made, and there's really no risk. So try it out. Now back to the video. So today I have a awesome, awesome person to talk about. His name is Dr. Ferran. PhD. He has about 20,000 subscribers. And very recently, I got in trouble on my channel because people said that I was punching down on someone. I would like to say the title of this video by Doc Ferran is Weightlifters Pound Pussy While Virgins Do Cardio. Now, am I punching down or am I just talking about a fucked up guy? <laughs> How was that title allowed on YouTube? <laughs> Okay, well, okay, that's a good question because I have um, I have a couple more of his titles that I think we could read out loud. Read <laughs> off the first one, they're really good. Cure social sexual anxiety and get head from hot girls by becoming a night girl promoter. Yes. Hashtag doc rant. <laughs> So he's saying that to, to cure social anxiety, you become a nightclub promoter and put yourself in a power position to then, I don't know, I, I guess uh, sleep with, with girls. Uh, one of my yeah. favorite titles is, is called uh, Bitch Tits, Gynecomastia slash Man Boobs. Testosterone is the natural solution. Now that one I think is really interesting because it, I, honestly, I see bitch tits, I click, you know? Well, yeah, for sure. Definitely. Yeah. This next one you should you should censor, but um Vegan Gains is a fucking arsler. Okay. Fifty five thousand views. That okay. That's that's, cool. that's his most viewed video. Of course. Again, it's it's super clickable. Vegan Gains, I guess, is a, one of his like uh, battling uh, gym type YouTube channels. So he really called him out with that. What about No Dick Left Unsucked? Now that one didn't. The algorithm did not catch that one, which is okay. I guess I guess that's good. I guess that's good. And then finally, what about the last one? What to do when you're. <laughs> <God>. <laughs> <laughs> what to do when your cock gets bored of your girlfriend? Yeah. Hashtag what's up, doc? Episode 11. <laughs> Jesus Christ. So I'm super excited to share with you, Doc Ferran. Dude, I am so scared. <laughs> no, he's awesome. Come on. This guy looks so scary. He looks insane. He looks like a villain. Yeah, for sure. Uh, I do like the camo tank top. 
It's it's a nice little look. Yeah. I think he's going to be, like, nice and endearing. What do you think? I think he's going to be really caring. I feel like he's a guy that I could just hug when I'm upset, you know? For sure, for sure. I present to you, weightlifters pound pussy while virgins do cardio. I don't go to the gym frequently. I don't go to the gym at all. So I, I'm trying to, like, learn something, I guess. And, and maybe... Yeah, uh, no fair. I, I don't know. Maybe teach Saji a lesson or two. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, that's cool. Yeah, because it, it <laughs> seems like you're one of these people that do cardio, and I'm here lifting weights. Yeah, I do a lot of cardio. Um, yep. And I also haven't had sex, so I guess that would align. Uh-huh. Um, and I'm lifting but, weights, Yeah. and you don't want to know what I've been up to. <laughs> yeah. No, yeah. Pounding it all. Okay. What's up, Pimp Daddy? <laughs> Dr. Testosterone here again right after my gym workout today. So he just got done with his gym workout. <laughs> Not his workout, but his gym workout specifically. I'm just I'm just very confused right now as to if he's a real doctor. Is he a real doctor? I feel like he is, right? Because why would you put PhD if you weren't? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's fair. I don't know what he's a doctor in besides pounding puss. <laughs> you know what I mean? This guy yeah. rocks. I love him. Also love this like freeze frame right here. He looks insane. You know what? I think PhD actually stands for <laughs> pussy. Um, Hog destroyer. Uh, hog destroyer. Pussy hog destroyer. <laughs> True. <laughs> yep. I guess I'm a PhD as well, and you're a... Uh... <laughs> guess I have a PhD. Oh, I mean, I don't yet, but I, I'm going to learn and get my PhD. Yeah, 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 for sure. Right now, yeah. you're a little, a little virgin who does cardio, yeah. and it's fine. It's fine, but I got my PhD. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Today, I did some bench press over here at the LA Fitness amazing workout in this video you will learn a lot about evolutionary psychology i will teach you why weightlifters get pussy and virgins do cardio his expressions they're, they're really so good. much yeah they're just i'm i just sprinted for three hours and this is why virgins do cardio yeah and i lift weights yeah he like every Every like freeze frame is a thumbnail photo. Yeah, he's no, 100 shocked at everything, which is honestly really great. I'm looking forward to learning like what he has to say. And what I wonder yeah. if he learned this in college when he was getting his doctorate. I would assume so. <laughs> this is where he's getting all of his facts from. Now, in terms of the gym, it is a microcosm of the savanna. What? A microcosm is anything that is small that represents something bigger. So the gym represents the savanna. What the fuck is a savanna? 300,000 years ago, or certain hundreds of thousands of years ago, our ancestors lived on the savanna where they were killing animals. The animals were trying to kill them. They had to lift rocks, lift trees. <laughs> they had to jump. They had to escape from predators. <laughs> okay. I'm f I'm very interested to see where this is going. Yeah, I guess I don't <laughs> I guess I don't understand. Because like what correlation is he gonna draw here? Yeah, I, I think it's fun that he's like giving us like a little lesson on the savanna yeah. and how like he also had to like clarify. He was like, and we were chasing after animals and also Animals were chasing after us. All of those movements are primal movements. They are involved in weightlifting, and that is what weightlifters do at the gym. That is what an alpha male is. Whereas... Uh-oh. Okay, wait. Okay, sorry. Uh, he's kind of describing, like, hunting and stuff. Yes. As being weightlifting in the gym. As a virgin that only does cardio, sure. I just want to—I just want to, you know, say that when we used to hunt, you know, way back when, we used a lot of cardio. Mm. Uh, we ran a lot, and also we were probably still virgins because that's how we ended up having more babies, right? true, and not having sex. So that's how we're here now. Yeah, uh, but yeah, just had to, just had to, you know. Yeah, I think it's interesting that he thinks that people who were hunting didn't. Um go to hunt like they just like all the animals came to them and were like all right i'm here to get shot um yeah time to lift weight and yeah wait i mean i'm gonna lift this animal and do 
bench presses. Yeah, bench presses with its corpse. Good. <laughs> People who do cardio for 45 minutes to an hour, they are slowly jogging. They are the beta males of society. True. Why? Because they're going to lose muscle. They're going to... Oh my God, did you see that? Yeah. They're going to lose that muscle was... and then shows off his little... His little bitch tits. They're gonna lose, they're gonna lose muscle. Don't yeah, look, don't yeah. <laughs> don't look. Sorry. Can you <laughs> censor this? <laughs> How fucking funny is it that he's talking about like beta males and like alpha males in front of a goddamn party city? Like yeah. you can get fucking helium balloons right behind you and like dollar yeah. trees behind you, and you're like, uh, yeah, people who do cardio are fucking pussies. Okay. Yeah. Well, not not uh, fucking pussies, but but just pussies in general yeah you know? they are just pussies yeah i i would know because i'm one of them unfortunately yeah but hopefully i mean we're a minute 30 in by the end of this video you'll be lifting weights and getting the ladies <laughs> if you do the wrong type of cardio then your testosterone will drop now i'm gonna get a little bit later to what the right and wrong type of cardio is but remember the primal movements like squats, deadlifts, lunges, pull-ups, all of these are movements that our ancestors did back in the day, 300,000 years ago, million years ago, in the savannah. So when you had... <laughs> what? I don't think that's true. I, I, I'm pretty sure it wasn't, I don't think, no. 300,000 years ago we were lifting weights. Yeah, I don't, I don't think so either. I also think it's funny that like he's like, yeah, back a million years ago they did pull-ups. <laughs> what? What purpose did they have to do pull-ups? Yeah, their only concern was eat, sleep, poop. Like, why would they be like, I'm gonna go get big muscles now? Yeah, yeah, maybe recreate if they're, if they're feeling frisky. He is captivating me with all of his facial expressions. So I do have to give him To kill an animal, you had to lift stuff. You had to climb up on a tree like a fucking pull- <laughs> This car just <laughs> runs him over, imagine. Oh my god. <laughs> get out of the fucking road. I just no, got a birthday yeah, card. It's hilarious because if I I was there, if I was in that car right there, I would have been terrified. Like, what does this guy do in the middle <laughs> yeah. of the parking lot at 12 a.m.? Yeah, this guy in, lost my shit. This guy in camo showing off his chest hair. Yeah. To do squats because you had to look around for predators. All of these primal movements exist because our ancestors did them and they are the fucking movements that boost testosterone the most. Am I? I may be fully uneducated, but like he's saying that like doing squats boost testosterone. Doesn't any form of exercise just inherently boost testosterone too? Not cardio, obviously. Oh fuck! Obviously. No, you're right. Yeah, I don't have any testosterone. <laughs> yeah. I'm a widow baby. Yeah, <laughs> all that running. Yeah. Was a big mistake, buddy. Sorry. <laughs> Look at how angry he is in this. In this. No, he's so frame upset. Right here. I'm definitely. I'm convinced he's on at least one drug. <laughs> For <laughs> like, sure. There's no way he's soap. There's no way. No, absolutely not. I want to believe that he's like parked like at where the LA Fitness is, and he's like yeah. took a stroll out to the end of the parking lot to yeah, record a video. Right. Yeah, because he doesn't want his gym bros to see him recording on a a Canon <laughs> G7X. What do you think? boost testosterone more a squat or b leg press okay oh my god this is like fucking it's a hard, hard question squat or leg press jake um um squat okay you're saying squat okay i'm gonna go with leg press then okay i think squat because squat is um more primal than leg press okay well i'd have to not agree with you there, uh, because <laughs> see, back in the day, three hundred thousand years ago, yes, uh, when man had to hunt to live, uh -huh. uh, when they when they hunted um, their prey, like I don't know, a deer mm -hmm. or a sheep, or if it were me, it would have been a lion. Um, of the course. first thing they do, they they don't they don't eat it at first. They do leg presses with the animal to get the meat nice and soft and tender, oh. um, and then they and then they eat the meat. But it just tastes that much better because they did the leg press with the animal. So therefore, that's where I'm going with leg so press. So they tenderize their meat with a leg press. Yeah. And so you did that with a a, li a lion. You're saying? Or no, not me. My like ancestors. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, it's a squat. Fuck. Lift is the best exercise for increasing testosterone. That's you know right. 
because it uses large muscles. True, it, it does. Like the butt, the glute. <laughs> yeah, it uses the butt. <laughs> Like the butt. <laughs> what? Like the butt? What is? What do you mean? Is it the ass or not? What are you talking about? Big muscles, like the butt. Uh, like maybe? the, uh, <laughs> like the ass. He sounds I guess? really. He sounds really unsure. Of himself. <laughs> yeah. He was like, like the butt, maybe. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit! The quads, the hamstrings, the big leg muscles and butt muscles. Okay, can I just say? It feels like he's holding me at Whoops. my neck. It feels like he's choking me. Every time he's mm. talking, his head, like, you could tell he's just so tense. For sure. And I just feel like I'm being strangled as he talks. No, yeah, absolutely. He's, he definitely treats women right. <laughs> 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 he's definitely a really nice guy in person. Maybe I'm going to go out a, on a little bit of a limb here. What's roid rage? Ooh. Okay. I feel like, I feel like that could be very, um accurate to the scenario right here i feel like it's very possible that he could be roid raging he just worked out why does he have so much energy that's true that's true did he work out though because maybe oh, he did he just ooh, or that's a fraud that's true and honestly i don't i feel like by saying that we're both going to get doxxed and murdered but um <laughs> doc Ferran, maybe he didn't work out today maybe he just needed some studio space but we come in peace and and we love you and you're definitely a real yeah, doctor you're great yes yeah PhD. Jogging the pussy workout. What? Wait. <laughs> the way he just emphasizes the P in pussy makes makes me like have chills. Yeah, but also he's making it sound like I'm gonna like strengthen my puss. Like I don't <laughs> like the pussy workout? What are you talking about? <laughs> you mean I can have a <laughs> You mean that I can have a really strong does it grip? Yes! Fuck it really does. <laughs> So funny. This Imagine guy knows his that's stuff. What he was advertising. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. How to strengthen your pussy. Yeah. Get that. <laughs> that grip. Yeah. Holy shit. Wow. Jogging 45 minutes to an hour will reduce your testosterone. You're not using any big muscle. You're not doing any kind of resistance training. I think that's the same car that drove by. Oh, yeah, it is. No, it definitely is. It was like a truck. Yeah. They're like, yeah, I got to see truck. this guy again. I got to get a second look <laughs> yeah. at him. Also, by running, you don't like get get muscle in your butt, as he would say. Yeah. Like, like butt. <laughs> yeah. In your like butt. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah. I, I guess your leg muscles. I don't know. This guy, I think he might be a bit of a quack. I don't know. Perhaps, but don't want to say anything because, again, don't want to get doxxed and murdered. That is what you need to do to boost testosterone. Now. Those weightlifters will get pussy. Okay. Tell me the last time you saw a hot model like Kate fucking Upton okay. or any other model out there. I don't care about any other model. I only care about Kate. What? But any other what? model that was with okay. a wimpy guy who you saw at the gym doing cardio. That's, you know, he kind of has a point here. <laughs> None kind of come to my head. Yeah, I think he's you know what? kind of a genius. I think he's kind of right, actually, because when I think about it, I can't think of any attractive person that's ever run before. No, I... Yeah, I'm trying to think. How about never? Every model, every girl who's hot, be it a musician or a sports player or a interior designer, a librarian, it doesn't fucking matter, okay? All those girls are with guys who look good they look big they're ripped oh, yeah they have game too don't get me wrong these guys have game they have confidence they have this energy that is masculine this testosterone energy they have it okay but then you get the cardio motherfuckers uh -oh. who don't understand oh <laughs> that when you are doing these marathon type runs, it is lowering your testosterone and increasing your estrogen and giving you the man boobs. <laughs> <laughs> this is such a weird correlation. Wait, what? So that's okay. His point is just so weird. Yeah. It's just so <laughs> abstract to me because he's just like, yeah, uh, I lift weights for women, not for myself. Yes. And if you run, you're clearly not doing it for yourself either. You just don't have any game and can't get pussy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
I don't like why can't we just work out for ourselves? <laughs> like, what? Yeah, he's he's so concerned about like us getting man boobs. Yeah, I, that's a big concern for him. I guess <laughs> I'm kind of lost. Okay, I have a theory. He, okay. he may have been overweight as a child. And that's he's a good just call. Projecting his insecurities onto us mm. and he's like um this never happened to me but don't get man boobies don't true. do it true, true 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 you know what i'm saying honestly i think by like looking at this i'd be like okay he's gonna be wrapping it up soon right yeah no definitely but we're yeah. halfway we're halfway through so we're uh, we're nowhere near done and wow yeah. i hope he says some more crazy things and the bitch tits yeah go lift at the gym be a fucking alpha male. True. And dude, one more thing, very crucial. Smile when you go to the gym. <laughs> oh my god, he's a fucking villain! That was terrifying. Smile. That was so when you go scary. To the gym. Smile when you go to the gym. Oh my god. I'm You're gonna scary. cry. You're gonna make me cry. <laughs> yeah, women cover their drinks when you walk into a fucking room. Yeah. What are you talking oh about? God. When you are doing your bench presses and your squats and your lunges and your deadlifts, smile. Uh -oh. Because you are so fucking lucky, you motherfucker, <laughs> that you get to do this these compound movements, so upset. these primal <laughs> movements without the risk of death. You don't have an animal chasing after you. Wait, 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 wait. If you had okay. an animal chasing after you and you were running, that would be yeah. cardio. That, that's what I was saying, yeah. But he's saying that if an animal's chasing after you, then bench press? I think that's, I think that's what he's saying, yeah. So if you want to overpower the animal, you have to be stronger than the animal. Therefore, lift the animal doing curls or you yeah. know, exercises. Huh, okay, well... I, uh, I'll definitely give that a shot. Every time that I'm like... Oh, also, yeah. Every time I'm lifting... Never. I will, uh, I'll smile. I'll smile from ear to ear. I'll do a bit of a joker smile. Mm -hmm. You don't have to pick up a fucking rock because your friend is underneath. His leg is being... trampled upon. <laughs> yeah! I wish he would edit his videos. Fuck. <laughs> Holy shit. His <laughs> leg was shit. getting cr tr trampled. So he was trying to figure out how to do that. But also, when's the last time you've seen a pal, one of your buddies, under a rock that they got trampled with? I don't... Uh, actually, it, actually, it just happened, like, just now. Oh, I'm sorry. No, it's okay. It's okay. It's, it's not a big deal. But if it wasn't for this guy, um, I wouldn't have been able to lift um, the animal... That was on my friend, um, yeah. up and out of the way. Wait, so an I had, to, I had to do a squat and a deadlift at the same time. Very difficult. Um, oh, but, but but I said I said if there was a rock on your friend, how's there an oh, animal? Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, there's I mean, an um, Saji, there's an animal on your friend. No, <laughs> no. Okay, there, yeah, there was. But then I, but then I lifted the animal. Uh huh. Out of the way. Yeah. It's really. It was <laughs> that sounds like a tricky situation. <laughs> <laughs> it was it was a very I, I woke up this morning and there was an animal a big tiger on my friend uh -huh. and i was like holy shit let me do a squat and a deadlift and uh -huh. lift up the animal and i did and i saved the day and now my friend owes me his life that's how it goes you know okay that yeah i mean if it happened this morning and it took you a little while to recall that story huh Mm. I wonder if you're faking being an alpha. I don't know. I was gonna say trampled, trampled upon by a tree. You don't have trampled on by a tree. Is the tree alive? Because then that would be truly horrifying. Then I would be like, okay, this guy might have a point now. Oh my god! Back three hundred thousand years ago was crazy. Yeah, trees were fucking alive. <laughs> Holy shit! That pain, like our ancestors had, feel very lucky. Smile at the gym. I go here, dude. I see all these fucking assholes with grins on their face. Oh, I have to work out. Hey, I don't want to go to the gym. Fuck you. Fuck <clears throat> you. Go to the gym. You are lucky that you get to go and do squats and deadlifts and feel fucking strong, man. Oh, I saw that you muscle. You get to do all that without the risk of death. Mwah. Thank God. He just blew you a kiss. Did you catch it? Uh, I caught it. I caught it. It's actually right here. Oh, you did? I, I didn't yeah. catch it. So I'm happy oh. you caught it. 
uh, because then we can both use the same kiss um, because I I wasn't able to catch it in time. Okay, that's good. I I feel less of a virgin after that. Really? Yeah, I don't know. I got a kiss from Doc Ferran. Look at his little smirk in this frame right here. Like he was saying that he was into like models and stuff, but like, I don't know. Is he into like a guy that's shaped like a a pickle with bitch tits? Because it seems (laughs) it. Oh my God. I, I, yeah, he 100% is. Okay, Jake, good. But I think you should be. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sounds good. <laughs> well, now that we're dating, let's see. <laughs> let's see what else he has to say. And the wrong way to do cardio, you just learned, is to do marathons and jogs for 45 minutes to an hour. Here is the right way to do cardio. Do sprints. <laughs> 30 seconds. He just messed that up a little bit. Yeah. He was... He didn't know what he was about to say until it left his mouth. Yeah. Also, where is his mouth right now? He's hitting <laughs> his beard hair. Holy like, shit! There's you're no, right. his mouth is not existent. It's oh just fucking god. hair. <laughs> his mouth is gone. Oh my god, Doc <laughs> Peron, where'd it go? Holy, Holy shit. shit! That's so funny. Wow. So balls out. <laughs> and thirty seconds rest. Thirty seconds. Balls out. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Wait. Wait. <laughs> Is he what is to sprint with our balls out? Yeah, <laughs> what the fuck? Like our ancestors, sprint with your fucking balls out. <laughs> what are you talking about? Sprint in a gym button naked. Yeah. That way you can be truly primal. Yeah, he's like, I look around the gym and people look at me in a weird way because they can hear my fucking sack slap against my thighs. <laughs> That's how you know that I'm fucking alpha. So he balls out, instead of saying like full out sprint, he's saying balls out sprint. And I, I kind of love that. I'd have to agree. I'm going to start using that more. Instead of like full send, I'm going to say balls out. Balls out. Bro, you need a lot of muscle to burn fat. You need to put muscle on your body so you can lose the fat that you have so you can increase your basal metabolic rate. Basal metabolic rate. <laughs> I was just about to say. What is you that? That sounds that like up a on the spot. Yeah, basal. I'm, I'm searching this. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh. No, it's real. But it's B A S A L. Oh, okay. I <laughs> I thought this guy just loved garnishing. Yeah. No, same. Okay. Only two minutes Basically. left. I think he's gonna sell stuff to us. I hope so, because I'm gonna buy it. <laughs> I'm gonna buy it for sure. If you're fat, really chubby, or you wanna lose weight, you're obese, then you may have to go on a caloric deficit. But a lot of you are skinny fat. A lot of you just need to put on some more muscle. Hey, why is he talking like this? He's kind of an asshole. Yeah. I don't know if, if he's allowed to be saying this, if I can fit a whole half dollar coin between his goddamn teeth. That is all for today. Continue being a badass. You are awesome. Go to the gym. Do the primal movements. Eat a lot of the stuff that you want to eat. And get that pussy. This is Dr. Special, And I will see you next time. Hell yeah. Woohoo, Doc! Oh, not again. Whoops. Wow. That that was was actually pretty amazing. Felt like I lived and died throughout that time I was watching the video. Yeah, I feel like, I don't know, I feel this new energy where like I'm, yeah. I don't know, I feel like maybe I'm gonna go lift some weights and work out my puss. So basically like in closing, Doc Ferran, the doctor ordered Kegels. Uh, Saji, so you went into this being like a cardio version and it's fine. Mm-hmm. Now, what did you learn? What are you now? Um, I would have to say that I've definitely uh, become aware of the harsh reality of sprinting and cardio Mm -hmm. because it really can be harmful for you when you know you can't have sex and that sucks you know sure 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 sure. um because you know i don't want to be someone who doesn't ever have sex just because i do cardio Mm -hmm. and also it's harmful for your health if you run which i've learned you know um if you run without your balls out you're a virgin yeah. And I don't want to be a virgin anymore. I don't want to. That's super exciting because I was thinking like when you do get stopped by police for uh, public nudity, you can just say, yeah. I was being primal. And exactly. Doc, this is my prescription. And then you just run away. Actually, you lift up the police officer and you toss them onto a friend yeah. that then somebody else has to lift up because they're, I guess, 
trampled by them you know yes i'm glad that i could watch this with you and thank you for like coming on the channel and sort oh, of, of course i think it was good to see the contrast between like uh super pussy destroyer me and mm -hmm. um like ooh, 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 you you know what i mean so um gotcha yeah well you know jake really happy to be here with you oh yeah I, been, yeah i know this has been this has been great uh, i know <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, yeah okay well just you know try to be nice so anyway <laughs> uh, <laughs> try to be nice <laughs> yeah. um just because you think I'm somewhat less than because I'm a virgin and do cardio sure, sure, sure. doesn't mean you get to trample all over me because I will lift you up with my biceps uh -oh. and do curls. And you're going to be in shock the entire time Holy as I lift shit. you and do curls with <laughs> you in my hands. No. That sounds a little bit romantic, but it doesn't have to be. It's a little romantic. I mean, I, I'm, already, I'm taken by Doc. I'm taken by Doc. He already blew me a kiss, but like... Okay. If, that's if I'm gonna if I'm gonna have my balls out and you're gonna curl me, you know, that's an offer I cannot refuse. All right, thanks for coming on the channel. <laughs> All right, bye. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and also, these glasses are on GlassesUSA.com as well. Check these out. These are Ray Band 5154s. They're beautiful. <laughs> okay, back to the video. Thank you to all my patrons. If you want to become a patron, check out the link in the description below. Also, check out my uh, clothing brand and fun for people with chronic illness. Never stop. Uh, August 1st, we're giving away uh, money to somebody in need, and uh, that's super exciting. And also, check out Saji in the description below. Saji, do you have anything else to say? I feel so primal right now. I don't know what's going on. Something has overcome me and I just want to eat raw meat. Mm -hmm. This is me flexing. Ugh. Oh. Oh. We got to we're going to have oh. to censor that. We can't we can uh yeah, can't don't give that out for free. Way too much. Yeah, definitely not. All right, bye Saji. Bye. <laughs>